It's commonly thought that the laws that govern transformational processes of the mineral, plant, animal, and human kingdoms are all quite different. This video presents another way to think about this by identifying what are known in alchemy as fixing and fluxing processes. Fixing and fluxing processes in natural systems are sharing common by all the four kingdoms. Alchemically, salt, or sal, is fixing. Its polarity, sulfur, or sulf, is fluxing. In today's scientific language, upregulating describes a sulf or fluxing process, while downregulating describes a sal or fixing process. Fix and flux patterns occur in all kingdoms, often sharing the same ionic transport sequences of metals like potassium, magnesium, sodium, and calcium. A simple story can illustrate the dynamics of these two most fundamental processes of cell fix and self flux. Imagine ordering a bowl of leek and potato soup. When it comes, it is raw chopped leeks and raw diced potatoes in a bowl of cold water. You send it back to the kitchen. The raw vegetables are too much in a sal fixed state. Alchemically, the vegetables are fixed in the gravity pole. You ask that the cook, who you know is an alchemist, put some fire under the earth to push the vegetables more towards the levity pole. The cook puts the burner on, and that pushes the water to change its phase towards levity, from being a liquid, which is self-fix, to being a vapor, which is self-flux. The water now is used to provide self-processes out chemically. As vapor, water is in a self-flux mode, as a liquid is in a self-fixed liquid state. The physical water has no chemical sulfur in it. It is in a self-flux condition due to the strongly self-flux heat that is pushing up from below. By putting fire under the earth, the self-flux quality of the fire is transferred to the water. As the self-flux quality of the water grows, the potatoes and the leeks begin also to move away from a sal fixed state as raw vegetables into a self-flux state as they unite with the hot self-flux water. The cook turns off the heat and the soup cools and the married vegetables begin to sal fix into a fine broth. As the soup arrives, as a fine broth, you shake some salt into it. The salt process have reached a kind of maximum in the cooking, and now the heavily salt flux soup needs some sal fix to bring it back into balance. Sal fix in the pole of gravity is known by many names. Precipitation, chelation, deposition, condensation, crystallization. Self-flux in the pole of levity is also known by many names. Dissolution, combustion, volatilization, rarefaction. These polarities can also be seen in the metals that are active in the changes from gravity to levity. On the cell fixed side is calcium and sodium gradually moving towards more reactive magnesium and potassium in the cell flux pool. These metals are present in the mineral, the plant, the animal, and the human. As a general rule, the two poles of any system oscillate between cell fixed and cell flux states and back again. This little storyline of these two dynamics in a bowl of soup 
is a useful way for beginning to understand fundamental transformational linkages that are shared in common across the kingdoms of the mineral, the plant, the animal, and the human. Seeing the linkages of fix and flux between the kingdoms is a very good way to build imaginations about how healing plants, how gems, how animal remedies, and how the physiology of a human being has a deep and abiding relationship to the natural world. Thanks for watching.